is Marist? I have no idea. How do you spell Marist? I have no idea. Have you ever heard of Marist? No, never. <laughs> While few people outside the Northeast had ever heard of Marist College, the school's basketball team established itself as one of the nation's best mid-majors in the 1980s. It all began when Marist hired Mike Perry in 1984. Having previously coached professional ball overseas, Perry pledged to bring in top European talent at a time when few other programs were recruiting internationally. Seven foot three Rick Smiths came from Holland to play ball and study at Marist College in Poughkeepsie, New York. Alain Forestier came from France, Miroslav Pekarski from Yugoslavia. But Perry never coached a game in Poughkeepsie. Recruiting violations and a personal complaint filed by a player forced him to resign before the 1984-85 season even began. Matt Ferjanic stepped in and inherited a talented roster highlighted by future second overall NBA draft pick Rick Smits. Under Ferjanic, Marist made its first ever trip to the NCAA tournament in 1986. But after a near upset of second seed Georgia Tech in the first round, things began to unravel again. Ferjanic's ultra-intense coaching style did not endear him to many of his players, who grew mutinous after the season's end. He resigned after two seasons in charge at Marist, and the program was once again looking for a new head coach. Dave McGarity became the program's third head coach in two years. Though he would ultimately bring stability, McGarity walked right into the fire. The NCAA suspended Smiths and two other big men on the eve of the 1986-87 season because of Perry's recruiting violations from two years prior. Marist eventually got its star center back and reeled off 14 consecutive wins to book a return trip to the NCAA tournament. Marist is going back to the NCAA. For the second straight season, the Red Fox is lost in the first round, this time getting blown out by a talented Pittsburgh team, a bitter pill to swallow. But it was nothing compared to the hammer the NCAA would bring down next fall. Sanctions including probation, recruiting restrictions, and worst of all, a two-year postseason ban. This is a story of Marist's golden age and its downfall.